Hello, I'm Jeff Yelton. I'm president of ScanSource AIDC and Point of Sale. And with me today, I have Bob Johnson from Cisco. Um, Bob has responsibility for uh, strategy, worldwide strategy for the mobility business. And I appreciate you spending some time with us. Thanks, Jeff. I'm glad to be here. Appreciate that. Um, obviously, a few weeks ago, I spent some time with you up at the Cisco Partner Conference in Boston. And up there, I sat into some of your presentations and, and heard a lot of the uh, uh, presentations that Cisco in general had up there. And one of the points that y'all made is that Cisco wanted to become an architecture company and was moving in that direction to set the architecture for the 21st century. Very similar to how IBM did back in the 60s and 70s with the 360 and 370 uh, technology. And then again, when uh, Microsoft did it around the architecture associated with um, desktop computing. And so I wanted to see if you could uh, kind of explain to uh, our VARs what you mean by Cisco wanting to become a architecture company. Sure, uh, and, and Jeff, I think this is really, we're looking at customer trends and how those trends are kind of driving us and how we organize our company and how we go to market. So, okay. uh, so if you look at number one customer trend that we're seeing is the whole trend around collaboration. So uh, I think if it w we wouldn't have to go far to look at, at our customer base and our VAR community that's looking at how do I collaborate anytime, anywhere with any device? I yeah. want to be able to uh, connect. I want to be able to do web conferencing. I want to be able to do, uh, I, I want to do social networking. I'd like to do some video uh, conferencing perhaps, maybe even some telepresence. Um, so that whole collaboration is used to be collaborating in a conference room such as this. Yep, right. Now that there's no borders anymore for that collaboration. So everything is going mobile and every one is going mobile. The number of devices in the next two years that are going to be going uh, 802.11 capable is right. one, uh, 1 1.3 billion devices in the next two years. So from a collaboration perspective, the expectation is I'm going to be able to connect back in to collaborate uh, anywhere I happen to be. Absolutely. I think we see that trend already even in the mobility side of the house. Uh, many of our mobile uh, device vendors are, are making sure that all of their devices have the capability to be not only wireless, but Wi-Fi also mm -hmm. so that they connect to the wireless uh, uh, networks. Um, also, when I talk to the VARs, I hear a lot of people wanting to talk about collaboration. They usually talk about it in the terms of a lot of the uh, technology that's available today from a Web 2.0 point of view, whether it be Twitter or blogging or forums or video. Um, and, and so I know it's top of their mind. Right. Uh, so I, I would agree with you on collaboration. Well, e even, even the partner summit that you attended, 1,600 partners came to that event, but we reached multitudes more than that across a virtual network. So they, they could come in, they could see the videos online, um, they, even, they even could uh, make comments in, in blog about the videos, they could, they could download the presentations. Uh, all as the event was unfolding. Uh, absolutely. I, I, I remember sitting in a few presentations where people were, um, Cisco had the Twitter responses up on the screen as people were presenting, and so the presenter would actually respond to some of the questions that came across on Twitter, and so it allowed everybody to feel like that they were a part of the overall presentation when really there were only about a thousand people inside of the room. Right. Uh, so it was, it was very cool. That, that's, that is pretty incredible. I mean, you think about where we've come from a technology perspective. Look at our, one of our customers, CNN, and how they even interact with, with the web and what's going on from mobile devices. You look, you look at uh, coverage of news events coming from individual people's cell phones right. um, or blogs or comments, and all those are being referred to on CNN as part of their business model now. It's no longer a separate entity. It's part of built into CNN's business model. Yep, you know, collaboration is a big word. I think that basically it's just communications between people through that's electronic right. means. That's right, exactly right. So collaborations as, as so one of the big architecture. So that's one big trend driving right. us to look at that from an architectural perspective.